The road to get here has been one of the craziest journeys that we have ever seen in not just League of Legends competition, but in any sort of competition. We're talking about an eSport that for the past few years has been dominated by the Korean scene. And this year, we've got a European team versus a Chinese team in the final. Both these teams and every player, every coach, every strategist, every analyst, every one on both of these squads knows the gravity of the situation that stands before them today. They've got pen in hand history book open in front of them, and they've got one chance to sign their name on the dotted line. Welcome to the world, no heroes and villains. Welcome to the war, we've only begun. So pick up your weapon and face it. There's blood on the ground, go and take it. You get one shot to make it out alive, so We have the return of an LPL representative to the final after years of touting their strength as potentially the second best region in the world. And it was the fact that it's Invictus Gaming, no one expected this dark horse. We knew that they were good, but we didn't know that they were going to be finals good. Invictus Gaming aren't even the best team in the LPL, and they now have the opportunity to be the best team in the world. They've never won a domestic championship. Hi, TJ. 어 아무래도 중국 LPL에서 우승을 한 번도 하지 못했기 때문에 이번에 IG에 대한 기대도 엄청 크신 것 같아요. IG가 되게 지금 여기까지 온 것만으로 쉽지가 않잖아요. 그리고 저희가 만약에 우승을 하면은 그냥 IG 그러니까 원래 선적이 안 나던 팀이기 때문에 IG한테 엄청난 파급력이 일 거고 그래서 LPL한테 이런 우승을 안겨주면은 그냥 제가 LPL 선수니까 그거에 대한 되게 자부심과 이런 거 영, 영, 그러니까 팬들의 약간 이런 거 좋아함을 많이 느낄 것 같아요. It's the road home for rookie. You have to understand, he won LCK in 2014. At the height of his career, leaves for the LPL with the Great Korean Migration. He's really left his fingerprint on one of the most historic organizations, a pillar of the LPL. To lift that trophy in front of a Korean crowd, it just justifies everything. It's hashtag worth for rookie. I made the right call. 로드컵 우승이라는 건 저한테는 와 이걸 어떻게 그냥 진짜 상상만 하고 맨날 꿈에서만 꾸는 약간 그런 일이라 생각해서 지금 이렇게 딱문 앞까지 왔잖아요 한 발짝인데 이거를 제가 어떻게 잘 해가지고 그 문을 뚫고 나갈지가 정말 관건인 것 같고 저한테는 진짜 잊질 못할 만약 우승을 하면 잊질 못할 결승이 될것 같고 또제 이제 프로 게이머의 인생에서의 가장 행복하고 가장 대단하고 기억에 잊을 수 없는 그런 일일 것 같아요, 인생에서. 2018 is not anyone's year. It is the LPL's year. They have won every single tournament they've attended, and now it's time for the LPL Dark Horse to finish it. Caps now going to be CC. Brox is making his way towards the fight. Ming looking to go in, jumps back, able to find the stun. Caps going to be taken very low. Hextech Automatum comes out, but it's first blood over to Ming. Caps. Caps has decided to go after Rookie here. Aftershock going to be keeping Rookie a little bit safe. Over the wall comes Ming, looking to issue that Hextech Ultimatum. Flash already going to be used. Caps trying to get himself away, but he's brought down for the second time this game. Caps and Brox in some trouble now, wanting to get themselves away. Stun comes through, Ning is going to be only held at bay for a moment as the Shy will collect the money on that one. Jackie Love should be able to get solo gold on this. 
thus making up the difference from the bottom lane and funneling a lot of money onto the late game Kaisa here. That is exactly what they want. No, 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 no. Rookie makes the dive into the back here now as well with the ultimate caps trying to get himself away, but he's only going to be postponing the inevitable. Jackie Love continues going further into the back. Breakfast already down. Caps going to be following him now as well. Maybe, 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 even if you're highlighting the solo lanes for this series, sometimes it's those guys that step up when you don't expect them that can actually tilt the series. So Ning showed up this game. On the worst end of a trade here, Ning makes his way into the lane, looking to find the gank, flash into the body slam, into the damage, into the kill, into the first blood for IG. Ning is making a return visit, and he's making it rather quickly. Ishina Shai goes back in, gonna drop the Vanguard's edge. Ning wants to show up here as well, grabbing the kill onto that one. And Ning again, able to have an early game impact here. I gotta say, I'm happy to see the Assassin AP Gragas <laughs> come back. But, but can he get out? The Emperor's Divide gonna keep him alive oh! for now, it's a double kill over to Ning! Shai still looking to find someone else, won't be able to land the stun, as now it's Rookie, who will scatter the weak to the wind, as a double kill for Jackie, signals no chance for Fnatic. And Invictus Gaming will continue their push, a beautiful cast brings Bwipo to his death, and that's IG taking us to match point. The LPL are one win away from claiming their first world championship. Coming into this third game, Whippo is out, Soaz is in. Bottom lane right now, it's where the action is. Speaking about ganks, it's Broxer going in. He's fighting the counter strike instantly. Hillisong trying to get away. He's going to be in some trouble. No flash available means Jackie Love's able to clean it up. Fnatic lose one. They spent the time to give the last hits over to Jackie Love. Two on the Kaisa now. We've got ourselves a very close game now. Here we go, though. Hillisong lands a hook. Hillisong wanting to go in. The box is going to be dropped down. Hilly can't get himself away, and Jackie will pop the plasma to go on a killing spree. Fnatic bringing the reinforcements as Hillisong tries to buy some time. Caps and Soaz make their way into the fight, but Jackie's already dominating. Rookie's able to find the lockdown. The damage comes through. It's Jackie Love! <laughs> Rookie says not done yet and then flashes in to set up the other two for Jackie Love to clean house. Rookie definitely stands tall. The time he has spent, the amount he has invested in his career with the Chinese scene means that he could very well make it all worthwhile today. Fnatic, they gotta look for it. This is their hope. Their backs are against the walls. The Baron is dropping down. Stop they it have here, no but vision. able to go over the wall. Brox to go in. He's he 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 the Baron and keeps Fnatic hopes alive.
好吗？没事没事没事没事没事，能走吧走吧走吧。Jackie's legendary. It's the solo laners down, and IG are pushing for the win. 傻没大傻没大没傻没大没傻没大没傻没大没傻没大没傻没大没傻。Roxanne Reckless versus the world. Reckless goes on a rampage, but Ning is still there, pressuring onto the turret. Reckless is down. IG are on the Nexus. The LPL has never won before, but that will change today. The Crownless are finally king, and Invictus Gaming are your 2018 World Champions.在职业生活当中我只试过爆破晴天就三次前两次全试因为我自己打得不好才输掉比赛就关键赛嘛但今天的话我也不知道怎么哭出来我一开始把对面激烈拆掉之后就我们拿冠军了就是这种感觉然后